Good morning, this is Paul. Behind me is a 2015 Ferrari 488 GTB. I'd like to show you around. So it's a 2015. It's done 13,900 miles from, from memory. It's Nero Daytona with a beige leather interior. So it's got a full Ferrari service history. I think the black and the yellow when you tie in the scooter rear shields with the ceramic brakes and the yellow calipers i think that goes really nasty with black and just gonna while we've got a, a nice bit of sun here i'm just gonna home in on this paintwork now this car previously had a protective wrap over the whole car so what that's meant is that this metallic nero daytona is in superb condition you can see it's really lovely metallic colour but the front end of a car is usually where most wear occurs from debris and stone chips and that sort of thing but it's lovely and if I just home in down here as well you can see that you've got the carbon fibre lower splitter so just looking all the way around getting nice and low here you can see the condition of each panel it's really really nice I'll come back to this wheel you can see the wheel which is in a sort of a satin black it's in nice condition the brakes you can see through there very good condition and of course ceramic brakes last longer than standard brakes as well the mirror is lovely looking around this air intake again it's not it's not chippy like you can find with cars that have never been protected it's and this area here, all just lovely. And then of course you've got more carbon fiber here. Let's see. Left rear wheel. Nice condition. Again, as you can see, now I'm gonna just come in nice and close over the rear bumper. And you can see down here, that's all carbon fibre as well, so the rear splitter is all carbon. Got the nice Ferrari logo. And then more of the sun bouncing off of that really nice metallic colour. Offside rear wheel. Lovely condition as you can see. If I just sort of pan down through the side of the car. See, there's no interruptions in the panel gaps, there's no pin dents or anything like that. The condition is just nice all the way around. It's only just come in, it's got to go through a, a full valley process yet. unlike the 458 this is the turbocharged engine and underneath here and yeah, the condition is lovely which is very important with a car like this because you've got a masterpiece here in red crinkle cut paint it's something you like to show off so the condition is everything as you can see it's just lovely Coming to the inside, I'm just going to show you this lovely leather with the contrast stitching. So if I can get, get rid of some of that sun, there we go. So you've got this nice black contrast stitching, which gives it a lovely amount of detail. You've got your electric adjustable mirrors there, which are also electric folding. Nice Ferrari emblems there. And then you've got this more of this contrast stitching. It's a bit of a low sun, so I'm, I'm afraid you're going to have to see some shadows there as I walk around the car. But the condition of the seat, the condition of the leather is just lovely. Daytona, because you've got these fingers through here with the contrast stitching, which looks nice. This is the steering wheel with the LED gear change lights in carbon fibre. Very nice. So you've got your Manatino switch, 
which gives you the different driving modes. You've got your wipers and washers, indicators here, engine start stop, adjustable suspension, um, lights, and of course your gear change. And then here you've also got your paddles with up and down, and they are also in carbon fiber. A nice GTB floor mats. And you can see your VD, VDA. So this is uh, an information package. You've got two. You've got your main rev counter in the, in the center, and you've got two different screens: one to the left, and then one to the right. And then you have these control areas here. So you've got navigation, radio, um, your, your turbo boost. Lots of different options there. There's your climate control. And there are your. There's your set. What's called the central bridge. So auto means you can flick from automatic to paddle shift, reverse does what it says on the tin, and then you've got a launch control, which with a double clutch gearbox doesn't deteriorate in the same way as they used to on the L360s and the 430s. It just remains strong. So you can, you can although there's little use for it on the road, it is something you can actually use. So just lovely condition all the way around. So, just press the start button. So you can hear that nice hollow note. Got to use walk up the glove box. We're showing 13,719 miles currently. Also got a suspension lifter here and then you've also got a camera system there as well which makes the car a lot easier to park and maneuver in and around town because of course it's not just a track car it's not just a racing car it's it's a sports car that you can realistically use on the road all year round so i hope you like the video i hope you like the car i hope you find the video useful if you'd like to know more about the car, please visit our website, www.clincardcars.co.uk. Um, drop us an email, pop us a text or a WhatsApp, or give us a call. And we'd be very happy to talk to you about it. Thanks for watching.